I swear to God, Manchester United can disappoint to lose a game. My United just want to cut my life short. Like, what the hell did I just bloody wash? Someone please help me do this match short short video because I absolutely didn't know what I just watched. When we can know that it's not just keeping possession, it's not about keeping possession. Football is about scoring goals, and when you score, you get your three points. When we can learn that, and when we might let it learn that, not sure let it lose three me against Bournemouth at Old Trafford. At Old Trafford, Old Trafford, where we call our first race, is not a play playground for for the bottom up. Clubs. You know what makes it so disappointing is that after having that fantastic and that worldly performance in East Chelsea, just a few days after that, you come and push up on the game where you have the advantage, where you were the favorite, and where you were not the underdog, you still lost that game. Not just losing the game, you were beating three me. I would even call it for me. I think you were had a very poor decision and saying that was an angle. That was absolutely funny in my own perspective. That was absolutely funny. I will much sure let's only do this the same and really the same thing moving on and on. I think after that game against Chelsea, our like our expectation high for Manchester United. Our expectation was so so high. But now my United fans have no hope for the club anymore. They absolutely don't have any hope. When we tell them that you shouldn't be starting Anthony Marcia in your games, just putting any, just go to the youth, youth and putting any 18, 18 years old kid there, he will play much better football than Anthony Marcia. When we tell figure that out, like when Marcia and the pitch were just a minus, he can't make any more. Masha was just there doing absolutely nothing. No makeup play, no shots, no, 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 just lots of possession. I absolutely don't know what I just watched from Anthony Masha. That was absolutely embarrassing. That was shameless and shameful from him. That was a shameful performance from Masha. It wasn't even a performance. What about Scott McTominay? Put the goals aside. Scott McTominay is not good enough to play for Manchester United. That is just the clear fact. Scott McTominay is not good to play for Manchester United. It's not good to be in the starting eleven. It's not good enough. Scott McTominay, I think it was been like the first time when Man United are not good in our attack. Scott McTominay will not have any goals. Yes, you want to put goals in this game. Yes, you want to be like Bellingham. Scott McTominay don't have the structure, don't have the structure to be a midfielder. Manchester United not good enough. He was literally leaving a man back there doing all the works, and I feel so pity for Amabat and I am aware they did all the cool works. It wasn't enough because the team let them down. The team absolutely let them down. Like, I think Tian needs to answer some question. Like, why did Tian not use that? Two players in the midfield and he went out to his tree. That was one of the errors that made all the that made the bread for the uh, the brand mouth players to just run through our midfield. Like Tian actually just made sure he used Amar Bart and a uh, McTomney Ayas in the beat and also Bruno Fernandez Ayas and he left Amar Bart there. You can see the game against Copenhagen. He played two midfielders and that was brilliant. Why did Tian not use the same formation, this 4 2 3 1 formation against Bournemouth? Why? Like, like why? Did, does he don't know that work where he has done that at Ayas, did the same formation, have done it at Ayas, he worked, have done it in the Copenhagen and he worked, but why did Tian still did it not? Like, shit, I have no words. Manchester United are just giving our fans no hope. Look at Old Trafford, just look at Old Trafford. The Old Trafford was just half empty. After just conspiracy, just after the second goal, the Old Trafford was half empty. Does that how it should be? Does how it should be? 
I don't want to see Marshall near the starting eleven anymore. I bloody don't want to see him. He's a total minus. <sighs> this one has been Marshall that we wanted to get, that wanted to be uploaded in the summer, and here yeah, you are making him a starting date for you. Like, there is no sense in starting Marcia. There is absolutely no sense in starting Marcia in games like this. There is no sense and there is no point. It's just total pointless. McTominay is not good enough. When will I say it? McTominay is not good enough. He's absolutely not good enough. And Russia United attack like I'm going to say Ganasho. Like Ganasho, like he played well, he played decent football, but. He's not physically strong enough. He's not the physique. I think he's getting body shame. Like when a uh, bonmot, I want to know why I always say Brentford. Bonmot are a team that are full of physicality. I want your team is not that physical. You are getting bullied. They actually bullied us. We kept the possession. We played. We played well. I think we played well for some time. But much time we were bullied. We were body shamed. The national couldn't make any noise because we were body shamed. Like. Like it was oppressed in that game. Anthony played pretty well, but he's stopping counter attacks and counter play. Masha overseas is an, an absolute disgrace to people being in that coming lineup. Our attack line was so so smooth with a rubbish and, and just a shambles performance. Our attack line today. I can't, I can't just bear what I watch. <sighs> I think kudos to my mother, but just to now buy but what they did what the team the team absolutely let them down they all they all go to them and apologize time needs to answer the question for not starting a two two class with two puppy vote time needs to answer the question why did it April to have vine the pitch Geneva just came from injury and started game immediately and I think the, the personal issue is vine to stop immediately time is an absolutely it's just a stubborn coach. There's nothing you can tell me. It's a stubborn manager. I'm still backing the manager, but I'm going to go with the fact that it's a stubborn manager. Genevieve came from me. They are starting, they are putting Genevieve in the game, but Varane is still on the bench. Full with qualities. One of the most experienced players. Varane will go to any top six, top six to Valley Club and start games, but he's on the bench in March 19. What is the point of starting Masha when you'll be putting Varane on the bench? What is the point? Luke Shaw is not a natural centre back. He's absolutely not a natural centre back. He was absolutely dreadful in that game. It was the total, uh, he was just clueless and was a mess in that game. He was, he, was he, he was putting out of his position, was it in his position? You have Varane there, you have Lindell up there. You are not playing the way, but you are looking, look sure at left center back, and that is not his position. When we turn up on the end, all these things, when? Like, when we be? I think he's in an absolute stubborn coach, and we can't continue with this. We absolutely can't continue with this. I'm not tired, guys. I'm still tired. I think I'll still give the manager some time, but tired is breaking on one third degree cause at Manchester United. Bournemouth Arrows won at Ultra Cup. Like, and they won at Utrecht for the first time. But what happened? Keep a clean sheet at Utrecht for but they keep a clean sheet on the return. But what happened? Scored three goals at Utrecht on the return. Like, Manchester United are just losing games at Utrecht, losing games this season, like, like a middle and only bottom half club. Like, it's just so, so embarrassing. I have no words. And what makes me, what pains me the most is, how are we going to go to Anfield and go to Bayern Munich? How are we going to beat them? Those two games are just a lose lose for me. It's an absolute lose lose for me. I have no hope. I, I, even if I, if I do any match, I have match with me, I will say no. Match time United are going to lose the game. That will be my score prediction against Liverpool and against Bayern Munich. Liverpool are a team that we were beating 7 0 last season. So going to, a, an, an, to, going to Anfield again, traveling to Anfield. We are going to be beating 8 eight men. And now the McNuggets have gotten a yellow card for absolutely no reason. It's not something suspended. Does that how a captain should behave? Is that how a captain should behave? For no reason. That was pointless. He was given a yellow card. He was 
was just having regrets and he was living again because for no absolute reason. If you go to our food, you will be beating um eight 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 me rather than eight one because you don't want to get six hundred. That is just it. I don't just now go and be again by my wish. That is just it totally. Against um Liverpool, we are gonna be disgraced again, once again. I absolutely don't have any words from us on the for this, but possession is not what you will use to win games. Possession is not what you will use. Getting a one leader, getting two leaders, two leaders, he had hope, but seeing that third goal, there was absolutely no hope. This is how Old Trafford should be every single game at, at Old Trafford. This is how the, the stadium should look like. Stadium being out, just being out and uh, secreted. The fans couldn't take it anymore. The fans were just leaving the stadium because they were like, we are not used to this. Why not I think that I'm winning? Just look at our missus and the sweetness in the world. <sighs> National United, they just, they just try to cut my life short. Like, I'm still not tired as much as he's a stubborn manager. He needs to learn from his mistake, but he's not. Oh, Nana as well. Like, I, I, I have no I have words to, to say. Let me. Why are you trying to cut my life short? They are absolutely trying to cut my life short. We are going to have feed. We are going to play a bad match next two. It's already over for us. It's a lose lose. That two games, both games are just lose for us. After seeing this performance, it is just totally. 